This was originally a residence hall uh, and was built in the late 60s and uh, we converted it to an office uh, complex. The significance is that we saved the building uh, rather than take it down, which uh, seven other small group buildings were taken down because they had reached the end of their useful life. And so we thought it was an opportunity to salvage it and uh, do something sustainable and convert it to another use. This is the first building that we've done since the university made a commitment to get all new construction or major renovation LEED certified, which stands for Leadership in Energy and Environmental Design. It has a series of points that you can earn in different categories um, whenever you do a major renovation like this building was or new construction. And the more points you get, the higher rating you get. So you can be certified silver, gold, or platinum and this building has achieved LEED Gold, which is even higher than what we're aiming for. What we are doing now is taking what we've been doing for years, for decades, in energy conservation and adding to it uh, the components of building construction, what type of bricks we use, what type of carpet we use, ceiling tiles, making sure the lighting is as energy efficient as possible. What were the student room bedrooms? Um, we're on a 10-foot module and um, they had a masonry walls in between them to reduce the sound when it was a residence hall. And rather than taking those walls out and throwing all that concrete block out, we actually saved most of those walls and then converted those uh, student rooms into open office workstations. And in our lobby, we've got uh, some bamboo plywood, which is a rapidly renewable building material. Bamboo grows so quickly as opposed to traditional hardwoods. The countertop material is also uh, just made of high pressure paper, uh, and so it is also a, uh, a product that, that we consider sustainable. We have a bicycle storage room so that to encourage people to ride their bikes to work, and then there's a locker room and a shower, which um, you can actually get points on lead for, and a lot of office buildings don't have that, and so people are reluctant to ride their bikes to work. We're working on sustainability in a variety of areas around campus, whether it's waste reduction or um, alternative transportation around campus, which is related to buildings, but it goes beyond that as well. So this is just one thing, one very significant, great thing that we're doing on campus. This is a great model for how we're going to step through renovating some of our existing buildings with our upcoming bond issue, as well as our renovations with capital funds in the future.